Yeah, good morning, guys. And mine happened to our friends there in the Philippines. Guys, just uh, wanted to come on here and uh, bring you some uh, some news. I just watched a video from uh, the Eco Farm uh, Boho, which is not 50 yards away from the Bohovo. She uploaded a video, Eleonora, uh, harvesting some of our vegetables. And you need to go and take a look. You really, I was quite stunned actually. Uh, the abundance of veg. And she's got trestles and she's got raised beds all over. And the growth is absolutely fantastic. And right there, in amongst it all, is Consing. Consing, who used to be in Boss Hog's employ and... Uh, of course, left because she wasn't getting paid. Was she, Brian? Have you paid her yet? But just go across there, have a look, and then have a think about what the brain surgeon is doing with that raised bed. There's just no comparison. Brian, if you're watching this video, which I know you do, have a look at the Eco Farm across the road. Because they are growing veg. They are a production farm. And that is a Filipino run farm. You know, the same Filipinos that you call stupid and lazy and butterts and thieves. Well, you best have a look across the road because they're, they're out doing you uh, hands down. And just to um, just to highlight something, Ian. Now, the other day, um, Gina was doing a house build update, and she panned the camera around to your raised beds, and she wanted to say something uh, derogatory, but she held back. But she did say that, uh, yeah, the boss man has been down and done some raking and she just left it at that but what she left us uh, watching was the fact that nothing was growing nothing was growing on your production farm as you called it we are successful in production production of what exactly are you successfully? Um, and while we're on the subject of uh, being successful, have you got a license? Have you got a solicitation permit for e begging? I think e begging is uh, illegal in California. It's probably not illegal in the uh, Philippines, but you're on your hands and knees. Asking for aeration pumps, ballot buying boxes, uh, donations for different projects. And how you can see as someone who was given to charity is a scammer is beyond me. You and your family are there begging for a house build. That's the biggest scam of the lot you don't have a budget you do not have any budget yet you upload a video uh, we're going to build satire house but you've got no budget so how can you build it scamming e-begging uh, we've had to put the house on hold for a few days because um you know we're waiting for materials no you're sowing a seed. We've got no money for materials. Please send us money. E-begging. You've got no permit for that. And I'm sure that when you uh, uploaded the video about the brain cancer scam, there was no morals there, was there, Brian? You sat on your eye, horse. Uh, 
I'm, I might drop a dime on someone. I might do this, I might do that. You're full of piss and wind. You can't do it yourself. You get all your minions, yeah, your trolls, to do your dirty work for you. And you're just an outright e-beggar. Sat there e-begging every day. The videos that you've uploaded recently. Who wants to sit and watch aquariums? Dirty, filthy aquariums and E. coli infested fish tanks for 25 minutes. What kind of content is that? And then you say that, oh, I'm not buying views. I'm not buying likes. You are buying them. You're hardly likely to admit that you're buying them, but you are buying them. And it's your supporters, the vulnerable supporters, who are paying for it. You, my friend, need to get off your eye horse and earn an honest day's living. And why we're on about honest day's living, uh, what does Marcel do all day? Because the only person working in that farm is Tatai. What does Jeannie do all day? Her English is so good she could get a job in a call centre. Why doesn't she get a job? I mean, there was a time, some time ago, you told Marley, if you want, um, if you want money, Marley, get yourself a job. This is the uh, mother of your firstborn child. If you want money, Marley, get yourself a job. And of course, uh, Dave Tilapia, we all know what Dave Tilapia suggested, don't we? Hey, eh? oh, Marley should prostitute herself. So, being on this IOS about uh, charities and uh, uh, scams, there's only one scammer, and that's you. You and your family. Till the next time, guys. Uh, keep your money in your pocket, as we always say. Do not get sucked in by this parasite at the Bohovel and the occupants. Bye for now.